Hey, what's up guys, this is Marcos. Today, I wanna show you my DIY teleprompter. So yes, this thing actually does work. As you can see, you can probably see the camera there through the glass. Uh, you see, there it is. Uh, you can see the text scrolling. So if you're in front of this camera, you would be able to read the text, look into the camera and read the words. And all I'm using is, you do need uh, a tablet with a, an app called DB Prompter, which is free. You can also buy one. Uh, I don't remember the exact name of it, but you can use another one. Uh, basically, that's all you need. Uh, now, let's talk about the setup. This I actually got from an old YouTube channel called Indie Mogul. I can't, they explain how to make this thing. So if you wanna learn how to make it, check out that video. That's how I, I learned how to make this. And I made this a couple years ago when I first started with YouTube. I was really bad at talking to the camera. So I thought I gotta come up with something because I wanna make videos, except I'm really bad at delivery. So I made this thing. And I only used it for a while because I wanted to learn how to talk to the camera with without stumbling. I really wanted to exercise that muscle and the only way to get good at something is to actually do it. So that's what I decided to do. I'm not gonna use this as a crutch. These are learning wheels. I wanna talk more natural even if I say ums and nas. Those things are gonna clear out after a while, right? If I just do it often enough, I won't have to use this and I can just speak what's in my mind. So let's look under the hood. This is just, uh, Oh, velvet, whatever uh, material you can find at your local uh, craft store. Uh, you can use a sweater. I've actually used my sweater and I put it over. You just want to block the light from hitting this area. Otherwise, you can't see the text over here. And this is just a camera. This is a contraption I made. Not much to it. All you need is some wood, some screws. Uh, and then you know, I, I use this pencil to hold up. This is actually a picture frame. So you can probably get this for like five bucks or maybe you already have something. You just take it away, uh, take it down from your wall and you know, you can modify it. And this is just the glass that comes with the picture frame. Make sure you don't get smudges on it. You got to clean it with Windex. That way it's super clear. You can see through it, right? Cause you, you want, you don't want smudges on it. And this will hold up like this, or you can use some tape. I usually actually use some tape to hold it up if I need to, but that's fine. It won't, it won't pop open. And then the pencil holds it up. The tablet here, there's an app that you need to import your text and scroll, right? And then the camera, even though, let me show you, where's that velvet thing? You want to cover it up. That way you can see the text. Uh, make sure this doesn't cover your lens and just hit record. I actually used it today for a, a, a client shoot and it went well everything was uh you know really clear the text does not uh i guess the lens does not record the text that you see on the glass it's just shooting through but it's not recording the text so if maybe that's a concern for you don't worry it's not going to happen you're going to shoot through it and you're not going to see the, the text is not going to end up in your video so this is pretty cool i'm not going to go over it this is a basic design that's how you create it right i just use some wood and lastly i mean you can put it on top of a table and bring it up i actually put in a you need a good uh tripod to put this on top because it gets pretty heavy but i actually did put something uh, a piece here underneath that you can screw on the the plate of uh of a tripod right and so this was sitting on top of my tripod and i was able to get the record it uh, three videos, three small videos in a matter of two hours just using this teleprompter. So it's pretty cool. I no longer use it, but for some of you, if you want to make more videos, you want to, you know, you, maybe you need to use training wheels for a while, then use the teleprompter. It's going to speed up your process. You're going to sound really fluid. And, and even if you're doing client projects, you might consider having something like this for a while because teleprompters are pretty expensive. They're about 800 bucks. 500 bucks somewhere around there you could buy cheap ones but if you don't want to spend the money you don't have the money right now to you know to to invest in something like that then consider making your own all right uh yeah any questions anything i wasn't clear about or you want to know more check out the uh, um the description for that video on how to make this thing because 
as a griffin is his name this guy does a good job of explaining how to actually uh, step by step process how to make this thing so <laughs> thank you very much for watching i hope this helps give me a thumbs up subscribe if you haven't already done so and i'll catch you guys on the next video